So today we're going to be checking out this Harley Benton Telecaster guitar. Stay tuned. Welcome back to the Guitar Manifesto channel, hope you're all doing well. So today we're going to be checking out this Harley Benton T20, which is basically a Telecaster guitar. This is the Harley Benton Standard Series. Now this is a used model, I snagged this off Facebook Marketplace for £40 and it's only a couple of weeks old. It is minty fresh condition, absolute bargain of a guitar. Beautiful colour, everybody knows what a Telecaster is all about, no frills. Just a straight out rocking guitar with just a simple neck, bridge pickup, free playing positions. That's all you need with these, they are awesome guitars. Pick this up for 40 quid, Facebook Marketplace, absolute bargain. Uh, brand new, these are on Tommen's website for £66 plus £8 shipping to the UK. So even at that price, absolute bargain. But the bloke I bought this off is a drummer, he also plays bass. He bought it to have a little jam with, but Telecaster's not for him, so yeah. He literally bought it a few weeks ago, so I've got a, a real good deal. £66 for a brand new one of these is still no money for an awesome guitar. And then first impressions, I was very impressed. I've had a couple of Telecasters on the channel before from Harley Benton, but I must say this one really did impress me. Really nice feeling neck, you got the maple uh, neck on it. Um, just playing it in the living room, not plugged in, it did feel nice to play. Uh, setup was pretty much there as well to be honest, so I did a little bit of tweaking but we're pretty good. Uh, I believe it's got the stock strings on. Um, they're okay, I've, they say they're 10s on the website but they feel more like 9s, but 9s is where I like to be. But I will stick a, a fresh set of strings on it. But um, yeah, I'll give you a, a little close up in this blue metallic. It's kind of like a, a Lake Placid blue like fender colour um, but yeah really nice finish these have a basswood body this weighs I think it was about 3.8 kilos and all so it's not a light guitar it's not too heavy but it's just right um, 45 millimeter thickness body so it's not like this you know like a bullet squire where they're 40 mil wafer feel this has got a nice bit of groove to it it's got a top loading bridge not a string through body that's not a deal breaker for me I quite like the the top loading setup, uh, yeah. But you've got their classic Telecaster setup with the neck pickup, bridge pickup. You've got three playing positions, so neck both together, bridge position, volume, tone control, output jack. You've got that three ply white pick guard. Uh, just a really cool finish. No dings or nothing on it, and quality control is absolutely flawless. It is minty fresh. Onto the neck, you have a maple neck, no skunk stripe down the back, 25 and a half inch scale, so 25 half inches from the nut to the saddles there. It's got a plastic nut, you've got a 14 inch radius fingerboard, so quite flat. I know that puts a lot of people off, but it doesn't really bother me if I'm honest. Um, medium jumbo frets, you've got black dot markers. It's got a modern C profile neck, but it don't feel too skinny, and it's not like a baseball bat like some of the earlier Harley Bentons, where it does, you know, really play nice. And I really do like this neck. No sharp frets, nothing like that. The frets are a little bit scratchy, but you know, it's a a budget guitar, so they'll you can either you know let them wear in naturally, it won't take long, or just polish up the frets a bit, but not a problem at all. But your classic. Harley Benton beaky headstock with a gold Harley Benton emblem with a standard series on it. You've got some generic Chinese tuners, but they do the job alright. Uh, I did stretch the strings out fully before doing a demo, and it does seem to hold tune pretty well. And it is quite cold in here, so yeah, not bad at all. But yeah, my first impressions, absolutely stunning guitar. For today's demo, I'm going to play to a backing track. I'm going to start with a neck position, then I'll go to neck and bridge, and then just that bridge on its own. I'll play a mixture of rhythm and lead guitar with clean and overdriven sound. So, next thing you should do is plug her in and let it rip.
So there you go, that was the Harley Benton T20 Telecaster guitar, £66 brand new, absolute bargain. I got it for 40 quid, so for the price of a, a budget pedal, I've got an awesome guitar. I'm going to be hanging on to this for a little while. So let me know what you think to it in the comment section below, whether you prefer the neck both together or just that bridge pickup, or just, you know, give me an idea what you think of it. If you've got one of these yourself, hit us in the comments and let the other people know what you think to it. I think it's an awesome guitar, very playable, really nice to play. It's second hand, but, you know, I presume this hasn't been set up. Um, the, the guy before didn't really know like that guitars, but it... You know, if this was out of the box from Tomlin, very impressed, I must admit. But only things I'd probably do on this, if you want to be really critical, is I'd probably change the pots out, get some bigger ones in, get a better cap, change the strings, and I'd probably change that plastic nut. The tuners, I'll see how it goes with them. So far, they seem to be holding up tune pretty well. As long as you fully stretch your strings, tuners normally are okay. A lot of people miss that point, but yeah, I think it's an awesome guitar. £66 brand new, I got it for 40 quid. you can't argue can you, so yeah I hope you enjoyed the video, again let me know what you think in the comment section below, if you enjoyed the video please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, make sure you stay up to date on all the latest videos, also follow me on Instagram, The Guitar Manifesto, so I'm going to have a little jam, a bit more with this, and um, I shall catch you all very soon, thanks for watching, peace.